please welcome the CEO of MAN Truck and Bus, Alexander Flaskamp. Change is the global challenge. It's the challenge of our customers. It's our challenge. This sentence is today more true than ever. However, it also gives an opportunity. An opportunity for a more sustainable environment, including and delivered by us in the area of transport and logistics. Welcome at our IAA press conference. Ladies and gentlemen, dear guests, dear colleagues, our industry is transforming with enormous speed. MIN is experiencing the greatest technological leaps in its history. This change is driven by three mega trends digitalization, zero emission, and autonomous driving. These activities, what we do, are highlighted here at our booth. For example, we are presenting how, on the digital area, we have an e-readiness check for their truck fleet to plan and operate their fleet tomorrow electrified. We are creating, through our e-manager app, the charging state of the batteries and predefining the right charging points at the right routes. We also showcase how our trucks will pay through our new digital solution, Simple Pay, at the gas station or tomorrow at the charging bay. Furthermore, what about over-the-air updates? We are providing already today that our drivers are updated in real time by, for instance, new maps. Our customers can digitally manage their service stopovers through MIN Service Care and coaching and monitoring the driver to deliver performance and uptime. It's about uptime and it's about efficiency where we use digitalization to excel our solutions. We will also excel in the area of autonomous driving. We show you today in our booth what is already possible today and what we have explored in closed areas such as terminals. Furthermore, we are exploring how we actually will advance in the second part of this decade when it comes to hub-to-hub -hub driving experience. The shift to climate neutral mobility is happening at an even faster pace. In the past years, for instance, here in Germany, the registration of electrical cars has been growing by more than eightfold. And I'm sure we at MIN, we are sure that the truck industry will follow pursuit. There are two reasons for the current gap. First of all, it's a regulatory setup. And secondly, it is the total cost of ownership. When the total cost of ownership of a battery electric truck will lead to an advantage over diesel, then we expect this will happen by the second part of this decade. And already today, we are pioneers of electrification out on the road. In the inner city distribution, for instance, you can see on the right side here the ETGE van for the last mile distribution, but also in local public transport. So at current, E is the most energy efficient form of alternative drive systems in the commercial vehicle sector available. And it will just grow. You can compare it also to another trend, hydrogen. But here, we have to take in mind that three quarters of the output is lost through energy conversion. Just to visualize it once more, one windmill can power three times more battery electric trucks than hydrogen trucks. And besides that, green hydrogen is scarce, it's rarely available, and it is far too expensive to reach the TCO parity. That is what we believe firmly and what also data shows, which will last 
first into the 30th, 35 decade. And that is why we are industrializing and clearly focus on battery electric trucks. For the next years to come, E is the name of the game. By the middle of the decade, we expect that the demand for heavy e-trucks is picking up. And by then, we will be able to build on our vast e-experience with our all-electric e-city bus and our all-electric van, as we showcase here in our booth. We have firmly planted our stakes in the market there where it makes here and now sense to electrify. Furthermore, we already gained a lot of experience with our small series ETGM distribution trucks, which has covered over 1.5 million kilometers in various operations and use cases in Europe. E-experience we also have gained through already deliver 350 city buses on the road and also 1,300 which are in the order the market where e-mobility is growing right now. They have been launched recently in 2021, but already now we see the e-city bus market really growing fast. And now, ladies and gentlemen, we are starting off to electrify our truck range. One of them, as you see next to me, is a tractor unit for a 70-ton semi-trailer operation. It is set and it will be ready to operate with the future mega charging, providing a charging time up to 80% within less than one hour. At first, the truck can be ordered with a daily operational range between 600 and 800 kilometers, rechargeable through a mega charging stopover, and of course, depending on topography, on weight, on temperature, and the parameters which are so unique in our industries. We today open up here our order books and reservations for the future. And of course, this heavy e-truck range will be offered with different applications. Every applications which our customers need tailor-made for their use and their operation. For instance, as a refrigerator truck, providing also the energy there as a tipper crane truck or also as a waste collector. In many of these areas, only it is by then that true sustainability, including the sustainable transport of goods, will come to real life. But rest assured, then it will be green, but not the milk which will be transported. From 2025 onwards, we are scaling up our production with an innovative assembly process which we are installing in our, in our Munich plant combined with a battery pack production plant in our location in Nuremberg. Then we are ready for the exponential growth when we switch over from combustion engines to electrified vehicles. Speaking about combustion engines, we don't stand still when it comes about conventional drivetrains. They also will become more sustainable and more economic for our customers. Our engineers have once more achieved a significant improvement in, effic in efficiency, now leading actually to an all efficiency gain comparing our TG3 to our TG2 models of up to 15%. This we have achieved by improved engine aerodynamics and drive logic software. At current diesel prices, ladies and gentlemen, this is giving a yearly advantage of six to 7,000 euro. So how did we do it? Our new D26 engine model for the year ahead will be again 3% more efficient, delivered by a further increase of combustion efficiency combined with a better thermal management. New turbochargers which are installed, and also by this we are creating 50 newton meters more torque and 10 horsepower over the whole range. This is providing then better shifting characteristics 
better efficiency, and also better driving comfort. When it comes to our long-distance cabs, they are becoming even more aerodynamic. This will contribute to a lower fuel consumption and add another percent to the savings expected. The one who is operating is even more important, our drivers. And we will make also driving experience even more comfortable, more easier, and more safer, which you can experience here in our booth. You can experience also here the top notch, our top line S equipment, which includes now also the most recently and highly decorated MIN OptiView mirror replacement system. This is a standard feature, and it's available on our whole truck range. It facilitates the driver superior view around the vehicle and is preventing then blind spots and blind spots will be with this system history. Have a look on our booth and experience our exclusive Lioness equipment. Our customers, ladies and gentlemen, can expect great updates in our models to be ordered here and now. And in the near future, we will deliver truly zero emission transport with our electrified truck range. What is missing out on the way here is a European-wide and a nationwide charging infrastructure. But also here, we are taking the lead. We are taking the lead with a joint venture and a variety of partners before we open up to, to build and set charge of 1,700 charging points in Europe. Together with our partners, we are ready to set the starting point for electric mobility that will be make sustainable transport happening tomorrow. And of course, we also count on the politics to actually make sure that this will be done easy and uncomplicated for the decade to come. Now, ladies and gentlemen, we truly welcome you uh, to our booth, experience our e-trucks, experience our conventional drives, experience our solutions, and experience the great Amman team.